Mike Hyman will try to take this. I think he's done enough personally, but we don't know. These are the marshals, race referees, the police, etc. coming in. We're not far from the hitting the finishing straight now. We can hear the crowds, Phil. Excuse yep. me for interrupting, but we can actually hear the crowds outside in town. There's the banner. They're going to have, I believe, it'll be just a little bit more to go. I reckon after the race, I think that's good time, which is just the finishing line. I reckon we'll be here in the next five minutes. And my pilot is under the heat of the sun. And when the sun comes out, it is a lovely day. But as soon as that rain comes, it is really ice cold. This has been another noted ride in the Amgen Tour of California. Yesterday was the hero of the day, was indeed Francisco Mancebo. But today, the champion has played a card. The winner of this event for the past two years, he just looked over his shoulders there. I wonder what that was for. It was probably saying, Peterson, don't you move. You're finishing second today. Or will he let him take it? Because it's time that counts. It's a long way up the home straight. Oh, my God, they are the right there. We have no idea. And does he realize this? Because it's still, if Mancedo is not in there, and I don't think he is, it is okay for Leipheimer to take over the lead. But it means that Michael Rogers, Lance Armstrong, Dave Zabriskie, if they're in there, are leaving this race again with the leader only seconds in front. And how often we said in just two or three days of commentary, this race has only ever been run in the end by seconds. Do you think he knows? He's not looking. I don't think he does. There goes Tom Peterson. Peterson has made the move. Levi Leipheimer more than content to let him go, Phil. But Leipheimer, they will cross the line. Peterson, the stage winner.